going on guys back with another video thanks for the support on the last video today we're going to be training shoulders uh, another key part to exercising is the warm-up so we did about 10 minutes on the bike and now I'm about to show you guys some of the stretches that you want to do before you start getting into the weights you're gonna go ahead with one arm and stretch that front delt out Kind of lean out to the side. So you can do this with a, a resistance band, but we're gonna use this right now. And this is from the back of the belt. And you're just gonna go up. Back. Do about 10 of these. For shoulders, you don't need to use much weight. There's just three parts of the shoulder, the front delt, side, and the rear. So today we're gonna do about three or four movements. That's gonna target the overall shoulder just to give you those juicy shoulders. Our first movement is gonna be a front delt raise, just coming up and down, keeping the elbows straight. Depending on your anatomy of your shoulders, you might wanna come out wider. Some people come more narrow. You can see the front delt activate as you're doing this. All right, so we just did the front delt raises. Now we're gonna do the sides. We're gonna do a superset of those going into the shoulder press and everything is uh, three sets of slow All right guys, so we did the front delt and side delt. Now we're gonna do the rear delt. Uh, you can use a dumbbell for this exercise or the plates or even a kettlebell. But with this movement, basically have your elbows out and you're just coming out as far back as you can without overextending. our last movement the shrugs you can use dumbbells kettlebells or even the plates i'm gonna use the plates that's gonna activate the traps uh, they're not necessarily part of the shoulders but makes the overall shoulders look sharper so we're gonna go ahead and hit that as well All right, y'all, so that concludes today's shoulder day. Uh, like I said earlier in the video, it's not about the weight.
per se, but more so your contractions and feeling the full range of motion in your movements. The shoulders are a very small muscle group, so it's more about time under tension and the amount of reps for them to grow. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and shout out to the camera woman today. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all with another one. I'm out.